Hey YouTube, this is Primetime Pokemon on my Primetime Walkthrough channel, here with another Pokemon Black walkthrough. We're in the big stadium, we just got done defeating all the trainers in here, so now we're going to head to Small Court, which is right next door. And in between this video and the last video, I did go to the Pokemon Center, so all of my Pokemon are healed. Once again, all these trainers on the outside here you can battle. So we'll have a double battle right away. Backers Joe and Ross. So I will use Surf, actually I won't use Surf, I'll use Slash against Zebstrika, and then with Reshiram I'll use Fusion Flare on Jellicent. Oof, terrible move. So, I'm actually going to switch out a Pokemon here. I'm going to put in Virizion. We're going to use... We'll use Dragon Breath against Jealous and see if it does much. Okay, so now we're going to use Giga Drain on Jellicent, and then we'll use Fusion Flare on Zebstrika. No! There we go. So now we're going to put in Tarakion, I think. And we'll move in. Yeah, we'll move in Volcarana. Pressure in. The jelly since she's a hard Pokemon to take down. Ever since I encountered those frillish. See there it goes, super effective. Probably gonna knock out Volcarona. There, Volcarona. We're gonna have to use, do the same thing air cutter and then heat wave. Great. I'm gonna have to go back to the Pokemon Center after this one. I can't believe I'm getting knocked out by Jellison. Well, we'll have to put in Samurott and see if it can do anything. We'll have to use Revenge against it.
There we go. We'll check Dragon Pulse out and see what it's like. So Dragon Pulse, 90 power, 100 accuracy. So instead, what does Extra Sensory do? 80 and 100. This is a Dragon type move. Dragon Breath does 60 and 100. So we'll use, instead of Dragon Breath, we'll forget it. So I'm going to have to go back to the Pokemon Center. That's an embarrassing match right there. But this is definitely a great way to train your Pokemon. What I would recommend is that if you can beat the Elite Four, I'll be doing that in a couple videos. I'll be going back there and battling them, and they'll be all have Pokemon in the 70s. But if your Pokemon aren't that strong yet, go to the Royal Unova pretty much every day. Come to the big stadium and small court every day, and eventually, in you know a couple days, you'll be able to get your Pokemon up and definitely be able to take on the Elite Four and probably win. But experience share is very important. I usually try and attach that to one of my Pokemon too. I try to level up until it can knock out one of the Elite Four Pokemon, you know, in a couple moves. So we're back to the small court. Hopefully the next battle doesn't take as long as that first double battle. So it looks like a dancer here, entertainer. Dancer Davy, two Pokemon. Mr. Mime is the first, which is a psychic type Pokemon. I'll use Surf on it. Bug type moves would be really effective against it. So I could put in Volcarona. There we go, and levels up to 84. Another Mr. Mime. Oh, I was too quick on hitting the B. I would have put a different Pokemon in. We'll just use Surf again. So there's one trainer down. We've, here's another trainer we can battle. Four Pokemon for veteran Sayuri. Relin Camp is out there. Double edge, it might knock out itself. Next is Dragonite, which, if you had an ice type move, would be great. Same with the dragon type moves. So we'll put in. Reshram. And we'll use that Dragon Pulse move we just learned a, a few, you know, a few minutes ago. Dragonite, what a great Pokemon that is. We'll use Dragon Pulse here. Hopefully Outrage doesn't knock out Reshram. Yep, it did. That's too bad. So I'll just put in Volcarona.
We'll use Silver Wind. Hopefully it'll hit. Oh, it shouldn't be there. Oh, it's confused. Good. So we're going to go for Heat Wave. I know it won't do much. Sure, it avoided it. Good. Try Heat Wave again. Now Volcarona is going to get knocked out. We'll just have to put Samurai back in there and just go with Surf. Hopefully we're going to go a little risky here and do Revenge. Hopefully it's confused. No, shoot. Oof. Oh good, Mag Cargo, a fire type Pokemon, so I should be able to knock it out in one move with Surf. Glaceon, ice type Pokemon. And it'll be weak against fire type moves and fighting type moves, but let's see what I have left here. Nothing too great, so actually I'm going to do something. I'm going to move in one of my other Pokemon and then use an item to revive well, probably Volcarona. So I'm going to go to the bag and then use a revive. I have 37 of them in my bag still. I'm going to use that on... Volcarona. And I'll probably knock it out in one move. That's actually pretty good. That way I don't have to spend a turn taking damage when I move a Pokemon in. So now I'll put in Volcarona again. Then I'll use Heat Wave. So since my Pokemon took a lot of damage that turn, I still have quite a few trainers to battle the small court here. I'm going to make my way to the Pokemon Center, heal my Pokemon, and then in the next video I'll come back to the small court and finish battling all the trainers there. And then I'll head to Route 5, which is right to the west there. Like I was saying with that Dragonite, on Pokemon Crystal, the first Pokemon game that I ever played, I got that up to level 100 right away, and that's probably was one of my better Pokemon. I actually defeated my friend. It was the first battle I ever had, and that was his first loss, and he actually played quite a bit. And I was using Dragonite level 100. I put a lot of time into training it up to level 100. So now we're back at the small court here, and we'll continue battling trainers in the next video. So thanks a lot for watching, and stay tuned for more. Thank you.